Hi, now we've got another example here on solving inequalities. In this one we've got a second rectangular tile of length 4y and width y plus 3 centimetres has a rectangle of length 2y and width y centimetres removed from one corner, as shown in this diagram. Now given that the perimeter of this tile is between 20 centimetres and 54 centimetres, we've got to determine the set of possible values of y. So if you'd like to have a go at this, just give you a moment to pause the video. Do come back when ready, check your work solution with mine, or fast forward to the end just to check the answer. OK, welcome back then if you had a go. So we're told then that the perimeter lies between 20 and 54 centimetres. Well, first of all, I just want to work out what the perimeter, the distance around the rectangle is going to be. I'm missing a few lengths here, so let's just fill those in first of all. If this is 4y and this is 2y, then clearly this must be 2y centimetres. And for this length here, we've got that this one's y, the total width is y plus 3, so that must mean that this length down here is going to be 3 centimetres. So now we're in a position to work out the perimeter just by adding those lengths together. So we've got that the perimeter okay, is equal then to 2y. Let's just put everything down. We've got 2y then plus y plus another 2y here, and then plus the 3, and then plus 4y, and then plus the y plus 3. So we've got that then. And if we just simplify this, what we've got is a total of 10y. And then if we add up the constants, we've got 3 plus 3 there, which is going to be 6. So perimeter then is 10y plus 6. And we're told that this perimeter then it lies between 20 centimetres and 54 centimetres. So I can put therefore that 10y plus 6 lies between 20 and 54. OK. Now to solve this kind of inequality, what I can do is subtract 6 from each one of these three values. And if I subtract 6, we've got 20 take away 6, which is 14. Less than, take 6 away from 10y plus 6, and you've got 10y. And take 6 away from the 54, and you've got 48. Now all I need to do is divide throughout by 10, and so therefore We've got 14 divided by 10, which is 1.4, is less than 10y divided by 10 is y, and 48 divided by 10 is 4.8. So there's our possible set of uh, values of y. y lies between 1.4 and 4.8. Okay.